All right. I don't want to get copyrighted. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. I'm here with Tom today, but he's behind the camera. Tom, say hi. Hi. That's Tom. He's behind the camera. So, I was looking around my room today and I saw two things instantly. One was this West Coast Eagles Premiership hat. The second was this West Coast Eagles jacket that mum got for me. And it made me think, hmm, how much Eagles gear do I have? So, I spent about five to ten minutes looking around my room, gathering as much Eagles gear as possible. And well, you guessed it, you're here. Now, if you're watching this one, I'm guessing you're an Eagles supporter. If not, comment down below which team you go for. No judgment here, we're all friends, we're all family. But if you are an Eagles supporter, click the top link in my description and watch my grand final video if you have not already. Now, with that being said, let's get right into it. Item number one. Um, has been hanging on my seven string guitar the whole year and that is my West Coast Eagles Premiership scarf that I actually bought at the preseason game of Eagles vs Dockers that was a fun one, Eagles won of course um, but that was there and I thought that was pretty cool No, oh, I can't not bring this bad boy in as you can see I still haven't hung it up on my wall yet <laughs> just because I don't know why, I just haven't but this is the West Coast Eagles Premiership poster that we got from the stadium after the win. They must have had so many printed of the Eagles and the Collingwood and thankfully uh, they got to use the Eagles ones because it made me pretty happy. Now, alright, this is funny. So if you watched my last video, you'd know. So this jacket here was one that Dad found on Facebook. Now, this jacket and these shorts that I wear to games they have not been to a losing game of football. Now that includes the preliminary final, the grand final, about three or four games last year, and the Eagles game, which was my last video on the channel. So I'm not superstitious about many things, but if I wear these two things to a game of football, the Eagles win. Now if Eagles lose against Geelong, I'm sorry, because I won't be there. But I don't think I don't know, I'm just saying, the jacket and the shorts, never lost a game. Um, now this one, again, I'm just putting it in because it's Eagles. It's the Eagles jersey, which also has not been to a losing game, but it's also only been to about two games, so. You know? Um, again, more clothing, I'm trying to get the boring stuff out the way. Eagles pyjama pants, these have travelled the world, baby. England, done it. America, done it. Across Australia, done it. Here in Perth, done it. All right, now we're getting into some more fun things. Flag that has, we're the big birds, kings of the big game, we're the eagles, we're flying high. We're the And as Dad would say, time to fly. Here's a clip. So this one is a uh, save the turtles bag. Um, don't use plastic, and if you do, reuse it. I don't really care, do what you want, but it makes me sound better if I say that. Tom's giving me this weird look of how dare you. Tom, what's your favourite animal? I enjoy turtles. He enjoys turtles. Alright, what could be in the lucky dip bag? Alright, Tom, do you want to come pick an item out? Sure. It is a hat. It is a scarf. Oh, oh, look at that. It's two scarves. It's a little bubba scarf, but... Oh, someone signed. Oh, two people signed this scarf. Hell yeah. Guess what's next? Another scarf. Another scarf. Guess what's next? Another scarf. Another sc oh, aha! Tricked ya. A scarf with a hat. Didn't see that one coming, did ya? Guess what? Another scarf. Another scarf. A beanie. Another beanie. Another scarf. A bag. All right, now we're getting into the more fun things. Thanks, Tom. Thanks for your help. You're welcome. No worries. <laughs> All right, next we have um, 
I'm not going to say his name just yet. You've got five seconds, comment down below. What's his name? I know Tom's now going to comment this the second I bloody upload this video, so he's first, aren't you? <laughs> well, if you guessed Rick the Rock, you'd be correct. Uh, congratulations, Tom. <laughs> you cheat. Um, my mate Jay. It's a bit funny looking, isn't he? My mate Jay got me this for, I think, my 15th or 16th or 17th or 18th birthday. Somewhere in those four years. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure. Sorry, Jay. Uh, but he got me this, so that's cool. All right, next we've got another flag. This flag has actually lived up on my shelf. Oh, I forgot something. I'm going to get it at the end. Tom can probably see what it might be. <laughs> um, this flag has just lived up on my top shelf, which I call my important shelf. Anything that's up there has meaning. I guess eagles have meaning. Did you see a Qantas plane had to make an emergency landing because an eagle flew into the to the jet? Wow, no. Yeah, RIP that eagle. Wow, there's a lot of stuff behind me. I'm a, I'm a mega fan. Uh, Alright, here we have a monkey wearing an eagle's beanie and scarf. I'm, I'm going to match this monkey real quick. Look at that! I'm the monkey! Um, I don't know where this came from. Ooh, sorry, I thought I had it and I didn't. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure. If it was a gift and whoever got it to me is watching this, thank you. <laughs> no, I actually cannot remember, but he lives up on my shelf as well, on the uh, second shelf, which is still important. Just not as important. I'm sure if I knew where it came from, it would be, but yeah, not too sure. Just in case, again, you're watching this and you got this, I'm not going to throw it. I'm going to place it behind me. Now, this one is a money box, but not just any money box. It's a money box that when you put the coin in, <laughs> that when it's turned on, Well, it used to play the Eagles song. <laughs> it's a bit awkward. Maybe I need to replace the batteries in it or something. Well, that was awkward. Now! The final thing that I can see in my room that I forgot to grab before. The 2018 AFL Grand Final Record. I think it was $15 before the game and I got it because who doesn't want it? But the thing is, I, I still don't actually know what's inside it. Maybe one day I'll, I'll find out. Maybe if, maybe if this video gets 10,000 views. <laughs> I'm not expecting it to, but if it does, hey, might open this bad boy. It's got dust on it. It sat up there for a whole year. Um, I have not opened it. Um, Hearn and Penderbury got front spot. And at this rate, it is still possible that this year could be Eagles Collingwood again. The next video you will see on this channel is an AFL Finals prediction video. I've been working with my high team selectives of professionals to come up with who I think is going to make the grand final this year. My predictions for the, I guess, seven, five games left. Five games that are left in the season. I have my predictions. They will be in on the next video. And to find that out, make sure you click the subscribe button down below and click the little bell next to it. Uh, and that will let you know when I upload my next video. Uh, especially if you are new here. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, it was probably shorter than I thought. How long have I been filming for? 10 minutes. 10 minutes. I could make that long enough. Anyway, if you liked this video, it's pretty simple. Give it a thumbs up. Click the like button before Tom. That's your challenge for the next videos. Tom always likes to get on and comment first before he's even watched the video. Well, God damn it, Tom! You're gonna get beat, and that's a promise. Guys, thank you for watching this one, and I will see you very, very soon for an AFL Finals Predictions. Catch ya!